Hello. Today we are going to be tying the boot near knot. Now I've just tied it to let you see, because many people say it looks exactly like the fishbone knot. And it's very similar, but as you can see, we've got four loops on one side. One, two, so that's one, two, that equals one. That's two, that's the third, and then there's just a little one here, which makes it the third, and this makes it the fourth. So that is the boutonniere knot. It's actually a pretty hard knot, which is why it is in our legendary category. So let's get started. I've also had to change tie because it's a very tie consuming knot. It's a very big knot. Alright. Let's get started. So you want the fat end to be just a bit above halfway between your neck and your pants line. Okay. Let's get started by going across, around, up and back to get that nice little V. Like that. Then you want to go there. Back and up like that. Now already it looks pretty nice and fancy. Now if we can see we've got our two, so one, two, and one, two. Then now that we've done two, we want to make it kind of shorter. So as you can see, there's just a very thin difference between this one and this one. You can pull it up maybe a bit more, but no more than that, so that it's the knot's not massive. We just want to make a distinct difference between the first knot and the second knot. Alright, we've got three there. One, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, here for our fourth, we just go up, pull tight, go around, and pull tight. And there is the boutonniere knot. Um, I'll just pull down. And you can tuck this little bit into your collar as we do some of the other knots like Eldridge and the Trinity. Then you pull it down. Now it's a bit big for my collar, very small shirt. But there you can see we have the boutonniere knot. Pretty complicated knot. Pretty similar to the fishbone. And there we have it. Uh, it's a very stylish knot, very time and tie consuming. It's probably formal for maybe a wedding with a three piece suit. So there we go, you can count them. One, two, three, and then the fourth one <laughs> is up there, so you can just pull that down a bit. And that is the boutonniere knot. 